From WFSB, this is an Eyewitness News Update. Good morning. Thank you for joining us on this Thursday, August 8th. I'm Tracy McCain. Well, two men are in the hospital right now after they were shot on Orange Street in Hartford last night. Police tell us they were called to the scene just before 11 p.m. The victims had already arrived at the hospital. Both men are listed as stable. There's no word yet on any possible suspects. And Wolkett first responders are back at Scoville Reservoir this morning to continue searching for a missing kayaker. Police were called to the area just before 6.30 yesterday. A dive team and a search dog scoured the reservoir, but the search was suspended after it got dark. Right now, the missing kayaker's name has not been released, but we'll keep you updated. We're getting ready for the remnants of Debbie tomorrow night into early Saturday morning. Therefore, we have issued a first alert for this time period. We're expecting some gusty winds, uh, tropical downpours. It could be some poor drainage flooding and isolated power outages. Now, here's what's changed. The storm continues to go farther to the west of us, which is good news. It's also speeding up. So that means decreased flooding threat for us and a quicker impact. But you can get ready for some nasty weather tomorrow night into early Saturday morning. And then the weekend turns out to be lovely with less humid, breezy conditions on Saturday. Sunday looks good, as does Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. Here come your shoreline highs, pretty equivalent to where we're headed inland and comfortable overnights for sleeping without AC. Thanks so much for tuning in. Have a great, safe, and healthy weekend.